like my mask? Great idea, huh? You got one, wear it like this. I'm gonna actually keep this in my car and if I need to go into the store carrying this. So guess I'm patriotic. Red, white, white, and blue. Not happening, guys. I'm very, very rarely I do only if I really get harassed, but most of the time now I came from a store today. I go to the store, I just walk in. Okay, I carry a mask in my back pocket, and if they harass me enough, I'll put it on. Sometimes I'll leave. I just pray about it. Sometimes I won't shop there. But I'm not doing it, guys. <laughs> Sorry. His blood and grace is sufficient. So really, that's my whole message. I'm going to kind of keep this one short. I got other ones on it, but look up the mask of the beast to the mark of the beast. It's just, it's symbolic of the demonic evil plot not even a plot it's his plan to destroy us and all it is is his stamp and saying yep see I got everybody see how easy it was I'm not a I've never been in the military I tried to join the Marines when I was 18 and they wouldn't take me because I had got in so much trouble with the law I'll leave it at that but one of the things that they do is they send out small forces sometimes, but they call them probing forces. They're trying to find the strengths and weaknesses of the enemy. So that's kind of what this was, was a ploy to find out. And you know what? The whole church got taken out by one virus, pretty much. I get it, that hurts. And a lot of you, you know, I have a lot of Christian friends that are mad at me that I even say that. But it's true. Look around, guys. Did very many people stand against the wiles of the devil on this one? No. Sorry, that's why it's time to repent, humble ourselves, weep and pray between the porch and the altar. But anyhow, I love you guys. No mask for this boy. I'm not trying to be the Lone Ranger. It's not a, not a civil liberty anymore. It's my liberty in the spirit and the bond of peace. And yes, I don't want anybody to get sick. And yes, I'll keep my distance from them. And yes, it is very serious. And I'm not mocking the, the people that have actually lost loved ones to it. It's sad. I get it. I'm not. I don't want to add to the hurt. It is a disease. But it's a disease, guys. So what are we going to do when plagues really hit? Love you guys. Uh, no mask. I'm going to know Jesus. And his blood is sufficient. Love you guys.